Known for his cool and quiet demeanour, Charlie Watts, by his own admission, never filled the stereotype of the rock star. And nevertheless, for more than 50 years, he was the heartbeat of one of the world's most iconic rock and roll bands, the Rolling Stones. Born in London in 1941, he was drawn to jazz music as a child and began exploring his love of rhythm, even converting an old banjo into a snare drum. With no formal training, the young Charlie Watts learnt by watching drummers in the jazz clubs of the British capital. After playing in various jazz and blues bands, he soon met Mick Jagger and Keith Richards and joined the Rolling Stones in 1963, which at the time he didn't think would last more than a week. Let's look over to the right. On the contrary, by 1965 they'd been propelled to international stardom by their firebrand style of rock and roll music. They would go on to have eight number one hits in the US, sell more than 240 million albums worldwide and tour the globe numerous times over, playing for their legions of fans. Unlike his bandmates, Watts generally resisted the excesses of fame and shied away from the limelight, finding refuge in his marriage to Shirley Ann Shepard, who he met in 1964. They had one daughter together and remained happily married until his death.